I have blood all over my shirt. I have blood all over me. He was all bloody. A Fort Pierce woman living in fear tonight after she says she had to use a shotgun to save her small dog from being killed by two pit bulls. And those dogs are still living next door to her right now. Tonight, Animal Control is investigating to see if that should change. Dan Corcoran has the story all new at 11 from Fort Pierce. Last night, this little dog, 8-pound Skippy, was under attack. His owner says pit bulls from the next-door neighbor's yard came over and went right for this little pooch. Skippy's owner, Fort Pierce's Patricia Sains, tells the story best. All of a sudden, I hear squealing, squealing, I mean loud squealing like I've never heard before. It was her 5-year-old Chihuahua mix in the backyard. I run out this way. She says two much larger pit bulls were going after her dog, so she grabbed her shotgun. The dogs are right here attacking my dog, so I took the gun. Boom! I shot them. They scat. They scattered, she says, but not for long. And they're trying to go back, so I started doing like this with the gun. And I got them to move, and I got them to go this way and this way. And they backed up. And when they backed up, I grabbed Skippy. She put Skippy inside, and then Patricia says she had to defend herself. So I closed the door. And they're up here on the door, and they're trying to come in. They're trying to come in. They're rah, rah, rah. So I took the gun again. Boom! I shot him again. I missed him, but I hit him in the ear, and they took off running, and they went back in their yard. And that was the end of that. Her dog was alive, but with several puncture wounds to his neck, stomach, back, and legs. I thought he was in shambles. Before I got to look at him and pull him into the house, I thought he was all tore up. I didn't even want to look. St. Lucie Animal Control arrived and cited the dog's owner for dogs running at large, for public nuisance, and for attacking another animal, an $850 fine. Patricia says she has no ill will toward the pit bull breed. They're very good dogs. They're very protective dogs. And there's nothing wrong with the pit bull breed. It's the owners. That's the problem. The owner of the dogs who didn't want to go on camera may have to surrender his animals if animal control deems them as dangerous. You're a survivor, ain't you, buddy? Yes, you are. Patricia says she's already made up her mind about that. So for right now and for at least the rest of this weekend, those two pit bulls are just right over the fence, right next door to this little guy right here. That could all be changing next week as this investigation continues. In Fort Pierce, I'm Dan Corcoran, WPTV News Channel 5.